Thank you. We have another very touching story here. Another Eights Heroes helping promote tennis for kids all across the area with a benefit concert. It's in memory of this person right here. You see Alex Rovello, a four time tennis champ. He went to Cleveland High School. He then went on to play at the University of Oregon. Joining us with a look at this summer concert, Alex's dad and founder of the Alex Rovello Memorial Foundation. Welcome Jim Rovello to the studio today. Jim, thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. Let's start off by telling us a little bit about Alex, you sadly lost him in a tragic accident. That was about five years ago. Yes. In 2013. Tell us about him. Uh, it was going with some friends uh, along the Mackenzie River, something called Blue Pool, Tamalich Pool, I guess it was mm -hmm. called. Um, kids were jumping off there for years. It was a total accident. I think he just hit wrong. And the good thing for me was that he didn't suffer. You know, yeah. it was, I think yeah. it was hard for his friends that saw all that happening, but. Uh, that was the good part of it. So, well, yeah, I love the fact that his passion obviously was tennis. Yeah. What yeah. a good looking young man on the tennis court. We enjoyed seeing those <laughs> Thank pictures. You. Thank you. Uh, so, you want to spread his passion to as many young people as you can. Are you trying to raise money to, to uh, bring tennis to kids in our yeah, community? Yeah, this, this whole thing has really been amazing. We've had Phil Knight, Tony Dungy donating money. We refurbished the courts at Berkeley Park. Um, it's been amazing what's happened, uh, and people have come through, and it's. Uh, just a tribute to him and yeah we want to continue uh, having tennis there and I can't tell you how many people tell us how nice the courts are oh, every awesome. day they come by and uh, they're beautiful thanks for yeah. keeping them and people have been respecting them too yeah, they, they've been really really nice well tell nice. us about the kind of person Alex was and how you hope his memory lives on you know he's noted for his tennis he was a good kid you know, I don't know you as parents too, or you will be a parent. Uh, it's <laughs> funny that, you know, when you get a compliment from somebody, whether it's a teacher or something that, you know, you just have a nice kid yeah. who's kind to other kids and stuff like that. That, mean, that meant the world to my wife and I. Yeah. And he was a great kid that, you know, at high school, everybody loved him. and. Uh, the tennis was just icing on the cake, I sure. think, really. Yeah. yeah. Well, the concert itself coming up next week, what can people expect from it, Jim? A great show. Uh, it's just acoustic alchemy. They're up for three Grammys. Um, oh, wow. And the Aladdin is a very intimate theater. It's not too bad. It's up for three Grammys, huh? Yeah. yeah. And they're coming out with a new album in the fall, and hopefully they'll win a Grammy on that one. I'm pushing That's for great. it. So, yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. we'll give you the details here of the benefit show for Alex Rovello Memorial Foundation coming up again, as Jim said, at the Aladdin Theater. And its doors open at 6 30? Correct. Okay, on the 26th, and where can people go for tickets? AladdinTheater.com. Okay, and you also have a website, the Alex Rovello Memorial.org. Yes. Okay, well, Jim, thank you so much for being here and Thanks for sharing for Alex's me. legacy. Thank you.